Now, today we know that radioactive iodine is not that safe. Uh, there, what are the consequences that well, people should there, be aware of? There are lots of studies showing that there you could have uh, increased uh, cancer, different types of cancer in those patients that take radioactive iodine. Local cancers uh, to the neck primarily or anywhere in the body? I think that uh, I think it was breast cancer that was found in lung cancer. I'm not sure. I'll, mm -hmm. I'll have to check on that. But there is increased incidence of cancer in patients that take radioactive iodine. So... Uh, People are now moving away from giving radioactive iodine, and they are going back to treatment with medicine, with the antithyroid drugs, and the surgery now. And why surgery? Because the surgeons uh, are extremely skillful today. We have surgeons that only do thyroid gland. So uh, we know that you know surgeons can do uh, between 100 and 150 thyroidectomies per year, those are the, the best ones. I mean, if you go see a surgeon, you don't want to go to that surgeon that operates 10 patients per year. You want to have at least 100 cases. So surgery became a very viable option, and this needs to be discussed with the patient and the, what is the, 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 the best option for that patient, considering age, considering a lot of things. But those are the, the three options here.